Welcome to Premath. In this video, we have got this uh, right triangle uh, ABC along with these uh, segments uh, BD and uh, BE, as you can see in this uh, diagram. And moreover, uh, all the segments uh, AE, ED, and uh, CD are equal in length, and they are being represented by X. And furthermore, uh, this segment uh, BE is represented by A, where A is equal to sine of X, whereas uh, this segment uh, BD is being represented by lowercase b, and B is equal to cosine of X. And now our task is uh, to find the value of uh, X. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. I'm going to draw some auxiliary lines. As you can see in this uh, next step, I have drawn uh, these uh, horizontal and vertical uh, grid lines. And now let's make an observation. We can see that we are dealing with this uh, right triangle. And furthermore, uh, these uh, segment uh, lengths uh, are uh, same. So therefore, uh, these uh, segments uh, AF, FG, and uh, BG are going to be equal as well. Let's assume that this uh, segment uh, AF uh, is uh, lowercase m, then this segment uh, FG is going to be lowercase m, and lowercase m this one as well. And likewise, uh, these segments uh, BH, HK, and uh, CK are going to be equal as well. If I label this segment as lowercase n, then this segment is going to be lowercase n, and likewise lowercase n as well. And bear in mind that all these uh, angles are uh, 90 degrees uh, as well. And now let's focus uh, on this uh, lowercase a, and we know lowercase a equal to sine of x. So therefore, uh, this uh, side uh, b e is uh, sine of uh, x. And now let's focus on this uh, lowercase b. And we know lowercase b equals to cosine of x. So therefore, uh, our this uh, segment uh, BD is going to be cosine of uh, x. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this uh, right triangle BHE, whose uh, this uh, leg uh, BH is uh, lowercase n. And this uh, leg uh, HE is uh, m plus this lowercase m is going to be equal to 2 times uh, m. And the high party news uh, BE is going to be sine of x. And we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this uh, triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. Here our two legs are uh, lowercase n uh, and 2m and our hypotenuse is uh, sine of x. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula. So we are going to have a 2m whole uh, square plus uh, n square equals to sine square of uh, x. Let's simplify. That is going to give us uh, 4m square plus uh, n square equal to sine square of x and I'm going to label this as our equation number one and now we are going to focus on another right triangle BKD whose uh, this uh, side length uh, BK is uh, n plus n is going to make uh, two times n and moreover this side uh, KD is going to be same as this uh, lowercase m so this side is going to be lowercase m and now we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this uh, triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem once again, a square plus b square equal to c square. And our two legs are uh, m, 2n, and our hypotenuse is uh, cosine of x. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. So we got uh, m square plus uh, 2 times n whole square equal to cosine square of uh, x. Let's simplify. That is going to give us uh, m square plus uh, 4 times uh, n square is going to be equal to cosine square of x. 
and I'm going to label this one as our equation number two. So therefore we are ended up with these two equations, equation one and equation two. And here I have copied down both of these equations. And now we are going to add these two equations. When we add these like terms, that's going to give us 5m square plus 5 times n square equal to sine square of x plus cosine square of x. And now let's recall this famous uh, trigonometric identity sine square plus cosine square is always equal to 1. So therefore on the right hand side this uh, whole thing is going to be equal to 1. So therefore we can write uh, 5m uh, square plus uh, 5 times uh, n square is going to be equal to 1. And now I am going to divide each and every term by 5 uh, across the board. So therefore this 5 and 5 is gone, likewise this is gone as well. So we are ended up with the m square plus uh, n square equal to 1 divided by 5. And I'm going to label this as our equation uh, number 3. And now let's focus on this uh, right triangle uh, AFE. And we can see it's uh, this side length uh, FE is going to be equal to this side length which is uh, lowercase n. So therefore uh, this side length Fe is going to be lowercase n. And now we are going to apply the Pythagorean theorem on this uh, tiny triangle. And here's our Pythagorean theorem once again. A square plus B square equal to C square. And in our case our two legs are uh, M, uh, N and our hypotenuse is X. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this Pythagorean formula. So we got uh, M square plus uh, N square is going to be equal to x square and I'm going to label this one as our equation number four and here we are ended up with these equation three and four and now we are going to compare these two equations and we can see our left hand sides are identical so therefore we are going to equate uh, the right hand sides as well so therefore I can write uh, x square equals to one divided by five and now I'm going to undo this square by taking a square root uh, on both uh, sides. And we can see x turns out to be equal to 1 divided by square root of uh, 5. And now we are going to rationalize the denominator by multiplying and dividing uh, by square root of uh, 5 uh, over here. And here we can see square root of 5 times square root of 5 is going to be 5. So therefore our x value turns out to be square root of 5 divided by 5. So thus after all the calculations and manipulations our x value turns out to be square root of 5 divided by 5. And that is going to be approximately equal to 0 0.4472 as well. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.